This is a response to a Reader's Digest article published on September 21st, 2018, titled 14 Exercises to Never Do After Age 50. Dear Reader's Digest, my name is Dustin Jones. I'm a home health physical therapist, creator of the Senior Rehab Project, faculty member with the Institute of Clinical Excellence, and I'm also a fan. I'm a fan of your brand and appreciate the information and the entertainment that you bring to many of the people that I serve. However, I and many others in my profession were quite disappointed when we came across your recent article, your September 21st article titled 14 Exercises to Never Do After Age 50. In this article, the author turns to several experts to discuss harmful exercises such as high-intensity interval training, spin classes, push-ups, squats, deadlifts. I do acknowledge you know, you're doing the hard work of giving advice to a very broad audience, but I want you to consider some of my concerns. Let me explain. There are thousands of healthcare professionals and researchers that are curious about aging. There are millions of private and public funds spent each year researching some of these questions. How can we age well? What are some of the best exercises to help older adults maintain a high quality of life? What are things a baby boomer should be doing to ensure health and mobility down the road? And what are these people finding? Among many things, people over 50 and humans in general respond well to exercise. And I greatly appreciate you sharing some of that information already. But in particular, people over 50 and humans in right, general John. respond really well to one thing in particular, and that's lifting heavy things. On the bar. How many reps? Five. Rip. Is don't sit down on it this time. Keep your hips high. Chest up. Chest up tight. Big breath. Push with the legs. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. 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 All right. All right. All right. And many people in healthcare have been working hard to spread that message. The CDC, the American College of Sports Medicine, the American Physical Therapy Association. The Academy of Geriatric Physical Therapy, CrossFit, Starting Strength, and my team at the Senior Rehab Project. We've all been working hard to spread this message far and wide that lifting heavy things is good for older adults. And your millions of viewers were just told a very different message. Now the term never from your title is associated with some of the most helpful movements that professionals like myself try to give our clients such as squats, deadlifts, and performing high intensity interval training. An article that was meant to prevent injuries in people over the age of 50 may have very well scared them from ever attempting some of these powerful exercises referenced in your article. You see, I work with your target demographic, 50 and up. I see your articles on my patients' coffee tables, on their countertops. We serve the same people. But now I and my colleagues have to overcome yet another unwarranted negative stereotype associated with these particular movements that have the potential to completely alter the trajectory of people's lives. Now I do acknowledge that making blanket statements about the benefits of an exercise without acknowledging the risk of injury would be negligent, yet we must not associate the word never with movements that can have such dramatic impacts. When guided by a professional, squats, deadlifts, push-ups, high-intensity interval training are helping hundreds of thousands, if not millions of people age well and maintain their independence. So I'm asking you, Reader's Digest, please consider a follow-up article. We can work together to share an evidence-based, hope-giving message to the people that we both serve. Instead of scaring people into never attempting squats with weights or attend a spinning class or attempt a deadlift, Let's show them what they can do right now and how to reach those goals down the road. I would love to help. Thank you for your time. If you agree with this video, please consider sharing.